Hey everyone! It's time for another Sydney and Richard beer review straight to you. Beer review! <laughs> so, this time we have something kind of interesting and special. Through my work, I was able to get a uh, beer that's not normally distributed. It's uh, kegged, but not bottled or canned. But uh, we're going to be able to try it today for you. It's from Figurehead Brewing Company in Seattle. It's um, right across the Ballard Bridge, if you're familiar with Seattle at all. Uh, the style is an English style dark mild ale, huh. which is not something I'm super familiar with, but it's dark, so I'm expecting something kind of roasty and toasty and mild, so I'm expecting something easy to drink, mm -hmm. sessionable, as the kids say these days. Mm. So, uh, is there anything about ABV or no? It does not say the ABV on this can because it's not an actual distribution can, but it's mild. I'm gonna say low. Low? We we can drink more after this. Oh jeez. Alright. <laughs> Let's do it. Oh, this is a nice dark color. Mm, it's kind of a toffee color. And then ooh, it's settled to be really black. Not like dark, but hmm. interesting. Maybe I, the bubbles make it maybe. lighter. It's a good head on it. It smells like I don't know, like it smells like coffee porter. It smells yeah. like that, um, what was that doc one we reviewed back? Post doc. Post doc? Yeah. It reminds me of that. You're right. It does have to, like, definitely have, like, coffee notes. With, like, a little splash of chocolate. Uh, wow. Yeah. You make it sound good. Well, let's try it. Hmm. It's watery. It is very thin. Yeah. Honestly, the biggest flavor is the uh, carbonation. Yeah. <laughs> All of those smells and everything, like, are not reflective of the taste at all. I don't taste a single thing. I get some kind of, like, sharp bitterness, bitterness like, when you're drinking seltzer water, you know? Yeah. Um, I feel like I get a little bit of roasty on the sides of my tongue, but it's really mild it's like <laughs> to say beyond mild um, it's mild to put it mildly <laughs> i don't think it's bad but it's not interesting yeah so what do you think what are your what are your overall thoughts on this um it's very thin very mild flavor great aroma yeah um it had a really good head and i think the color is pretty it's not pitch black it's kind of like a really rich mahogany dark brown color this is super thin to the point where i feel like i'm drinking water mm -hmm. um i feel the sharpness of bitterness but like i don't actually taste anything mm -hmm. it's like i can taste the texture of bitter yeah. but i i don't actually taste bitter it's weird mm -hmm. to describe it's definitely not like a hot bitterness like a no. normal beer it's like a coffee bitterness but like ridiculously mild Especially after that uh, nose, you know, the aroma. Yeah, it smells so expecting good. Expecting a great, rich flavor. But, you know. uh, yeah. Maybe, maybe I would recommend this a beer to someone who has never had beer before. <laughs> or, like, yeah. you know, really is like, I don't want to do this. Um, yeah. It's like, here, try this. You're not really going to taste too much. That's what I would recommend it for. Um, if you know someone who's trying to get into beer and they really like LaCroix or San Pellegrino or something. <laughs> this is probably a good place for them to start. Uh, uh, that's the nearest thing I can think of, really. It's just like, yeah, carbonated water. Yeah. I am totally willing to try something else from them. Um, I hope this isn't a reflection of all the stuff that they make. Yeah, but, I'm uh, definitely looking forward to trying more figureheads, especially because it, it really does smell good. It's almost it worth opening a can just to smell it. Yeah. Um, so we'll probably give that another go, and when we do, we'll mm -hmm. definitely post on Instagram yeah. so you guys can see what we had, and hopefully it's a lot better. So, um, yeah, we'll try it. We'll try and head over there in the next couple weeks and uh, follow up on this video and let you guys know if it's worth yeah, checking for out. Sure. Sounds like a great idea. So, um, with that, that's all we got, folks. Yeah. Well, that was um, interesting. Interesting. We'll we'll see what happens next week. Yep. Yeah. 
All right. Well, I drank it, so. Yeah, it's very poundable. It's, oh yeah, it's chuggable. Okay. So, until next pour. Until next See pour. See you next week.